G'day guys, Sci-Fi back again. Sorry about all the screeching cockies at the moment out the back. Yeah, back with another action figure review and a new figure altogether fantastic. Finally has hit my local zing. Grief Cargo, that looks fantastic. I will mention, yeah, I'm glad this is out because, yeah, although I know a lot of you guys do like the retro line of figures, I do not. I do like the old 78 to 79 line that they've done. Oh, not 79. Yeah, just the, I think the first couple from the original line that I first picked up back when I was a kid. 40 odd years ago, I liked them because that's what they looked like. Except for those dirty great big red stickers. Mandalorian figures have only been around for about a year and a bit. So I honestly believe they don't deserve the retro name and deserve to be retro fitted that's just me that's my opinion and it goes the same with those multicolored ones i don't <laughs> not for me i know some people do that's fine if you do that's okay but i'm just giving you my i just because the other week i sat there and i saw i saw this guy in the retro line and i said where's the real one come on real one and finally got him so yeah there we are there's the card. I think it's the same card as the retro one. No big dirty great sticker. And not really well. Um, the bubble's so deep. So I cut it nicely with my brand new Leatherman. That did the trick. Cut through like butter, but to get the actual bubble out was quite deep. So it tore the card a bit. That's okay. Let's look at the figure. Alright, and the gun. And the weapon. Tiny little weapon. And Griff Cargo does not. No, he's not going to stand for me now, is he? He's been good before, but no. I'll just hold him then. There's his gun, tiny little thing. It's the pistol. It's not too bad. It's all one colour, from what I can see. Yeah. Might have a bit of a burnishing looking effect on it. No, it's just the light. Alright. That's not too bad. It's pretty good. You've got the grey beard happening now. Gandalf grey beard. Mm. Grief cargo. Ooh. I oh, know. So yeah, to stop all that, this cape is very, yeah, flops in and out. It moves quite freely. But yeah, if you just sort of put that arm, the arms down, it'll stop it from billowing out. It should be fine. So yeah. And that's pretty much what he looked like in Season 2, different from Season 1. No other new sort of... No, just different clothing, of course. Yeah, it's pretty good. All the art articulation, I'm assuming, is very good too. Gun holster. What not. Face sculpt isn't too bad. The 3 3 quarter inch. I like it. It's very good. Okay. I like these little insignias here, it's exactly what's on there, so there you go. Grief Cargo's now a old grey beard. It's pretty darn cool. And a bit of a comparison. Let's drop the camera down a bit if I can. Please stand. Yes, he did. There we go, there's the six inch one. Mm, camera back up just a bit. Not bad. Now, I don't know if you saw the video I did on him. Again, it's very nice, nicely done. But all this varnish, all this big polish they put on the face of a lot of these figures, I had to step in and touch up that moustache because, again, Carl Weathers has got a big, giant moustache. I did as best as I could. I think I might have been a little bit overboard. But it's better than what he looked like before. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. So there is no three three quarter inch one of this one and no six inch one of that one. But that's cool. Got one in each of the line. It's all fantastic. I'm loving it. Okay. So there we go. All right, I'll leave it at that. So here's hoping since they've got Quill, or Kill, or whatever his name is, Quill, in the retro line. Here's hoping very soon I'll get a proper quill on the normal on the proper tvc card that'd be great 
All right, guys, I've got a few more to do today before I go back to work. And I'll see you all in the next one. All right, guys, sci-fi out. And this is the way.